Yo, what is going on guys? It is Get Scared here, coming back at you guys with some more Black Ops 2 League Play gameplay. And today we are looking at some hardpoint on standoff with the MP7, and I don't know, I've been using this gun lately, and I seem to be sucking ass with it, so I wouldn't recommend using it, but I just got a quad feed with it, so I don't know, maybe it's a decent gun. Who knows, but I don't know, it seems really inconsistent to me. But this is actually a really old gameplay, this is, I think, from like, I don't even know, seven months ago, before Ghost came out, I'm pretty sure, so I pretty much forgot all about it, I just noticed it on my hard drive, it said League Play, so I'm pretty sure it's a uh, decent gameplay, so <laughs> hopefully you guys enjoy that in the background, but uh, I don't know, it, I've just been craving some Black Ops 2 lately, I've been playing a lot of it lately. Modern Warfare 3, I know I've been saying I really enjoy Modern Warfare 3 in a lot of my commentaries lately, but I don't know, it's it's kind of just been getting on my nerves lately, <laughs> just uh, getting killed by support guys with like stealth bombers and all that shit and having them EMP my streaks when I get high streaks. Just don't run assault in that game, just always run specialist, but I don't know, I'm just getting kind of fed up with it, so I, I, was, I wanted to play some Black Ops too. And uh, I don't know, I, I've been running into a lot of booters lately, so I, I thought I'd make a little bit of a rant on them, and uh, that's pretty much what this commentary is going to be about, booters in league play, and I guess cheaters in general in life, I guess, but this mainly just ties in with... Um, cheaters in in league play because i don't know it's it's really really been pissing me off lately but basically if you don't know what a booter is it's basically when they uh they i don't even know what they use to be honest these kids <laughs> these fucking nerds i don't even know what they do but uh so they find a way to somehow hit you offline so or i don't even know do they even i, I don't think they hit you offline because you're, you're still online but they find a way to get you out of the match they track your IP down. I don't even know what the fuck they do. But basically in league play, uh, when someone leaves, no one else rejoins. So basically they just boot someone on off on the enemy team and then it's a 4v3 for them. So it's basically a guaranteed win unless the three players on the enemy team are actually good players. I've actually won some 3v4s in the past and it's pretty awesome when that happens, not gonna lie. That's one plus of booters, I guess. You get those sick opportunities where you get to do that, but mainly it's just really fucking annoying um, because most of the time you will not be able to win a 3v4 situation, especially if your two teammates are not the best. And if the enemies have any skill whatsoever, most, most of the time booters do have some sort of gun skill or else they wouldn't like take the time to like do so well at Call of Duty. They, they've they've got to be at least decent at it. But they're most likely not very good at it because they have to resort to this in order to get masters. And it's honestly just, it, it doesn't make any sense to me why they do it. Because League Play is supposed to be a competitive atmosphere where it's a challenge to win. It's supposed to be a challenge to win and it's supposed to be a good feeling when you win. And when you get master division, you're supposed to, like when you get master division, you're supposed to be a really good player. And it's supposed to be a really big accomplishment that you should feel good about. And I know it's a video game, and I probably sound like the biggest fucking nerd ever saying that, but uh, I don't know. That's just what it is, basically. And these guys are just cheating to get it. So I don't know what the sense of accomplishment is in that, but apparently they see it, and I don't know. Maybe they just do it to impress people. Uh, maybe they get the girls' attention at school. Hey, hey, check, I got fucking masters on League Play. Fuck me. <laughs> I don't even know. But, uh... <laughs> Who knows why they do it? I guess it, it's just they can't do it regularly, so they want to do it some way. But it, it doesn't make any sense to me why. Because why cheat for something that, it, like, I can understand. There are times when cheating kind of makes sense. Like, I guess in, in a public match scenario, when you just cheat and get a modded controller or whatever, or just get um, get whatever that hack is where you can't die, god mode hack. I guess that's kind of fun once in a while. <laughs> I don't even know. I've never tried it, but I can kind of see where they're coming from with that. But booting, it, it just doesn't make any sense to me why they do it. But let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Um, I'm sure a lot of you guys probably hate it just as much as me because I know this is pretty much the dominant Call of Duty right now. So a lot of you guys are probably playing League Play and whatnot. Uh, but man, it, it's just been really pissing me off lately, the amount of times I get booted. Like, literally, I'd say about 1 in 5 games, or sometimes even 1 in 4, I'd say, maybe. 1 in 4 games has a booter in the lobby who will most likely hit someone offline, and uh, it'll result in being a 3v4. 
And then usually one of the teammates on the, th the three team will end up leaving. So it's a 2v4. And it's just, it completely ruins league play for me. So I don't know. I really fucking hate it. But anyways, guys, hopefully you enjoyed this commentary. If you did, make sure to drop a like. And I will see you guys in the next one. Peace. Hard's always raging, then they get to fussing. Yes. They always rage quit, uh, and then they start cussing. Okay. I'm trolling online, but I ain't saying nothing. Uh, Cause if I'm in your game, then I'm boosting, <laughs> okay. busting. <laughs>